All right, so I've been fiddling around with the whole movie maker, and guess what I finally discovered how to do? <laughs> I I mm. never knew how to do it. Colton, I saw it in a couple of your videos, because you put, like, the black screen, you do a little type across, and I never knew. I'm like, how is he doing that? I don't know. So I, w I went exploring, and I found it, and now I am psyched, because now I'm guaranteed my next, like, three vlogs are just gonna have like words on every single little frame little hints and stuff like that i'll try to i'll try to control myself but i am really excited that i have discovered how this works as i said i wouldn't be recording anything in the weekend i was very busy so i will try to explain what i did over the weekend as quickly as possible so i don't bore you guys so Got back around 9.30, went to see Annabelle with a couple people. Went to Taekwondo class in my dress uniform. Dinner with Lauren. Hung in with Colton. Got a discount at the Army Navy store. Had dinner at Scott's. Watched comedy skits with a group. And Sunday with family. Sunday night I went to Kitten. She gave you this buff and left Monday around 3 o'clock. So that was about my weekend. Very, very packed in and rushed. But it was good to go home and, you know, see people. See family. A lot. It was good. Felt good. And this, I love this. This is from Survivor, obviously, as you guys can see. Season 3. Boston Rob's first season. It's awesome. I don't pretend to be Boston Rob, but um, it's pretty cool that this is from his season because he's a very well-known player. I mean, like, if you know Survivor, you know Boston Rob. There's no way fans are butts. So it was, it was good to see. I can't believe she gave it to me. She's like, I wanted to give you something special. I said, oh, I would say no, but it's Survivor. I love that show. <laughs> so I'm hopefully coming back in two weeks. Caitlin wants me to come back because her parents are out of town for that week. Um, so hopefully I can come back and see everyone I didn't see and some people I did see, you know, repeats and stuff like that. I'm not going to see his family as much. <clears throat> I'm not going to see his family as much this this time around. I'm going to spend it more with friends. This this The weekend, in, if I can get back, it'll be a friend's weekend. I did take one video while I was home and also quite a few pictures that my, well, my parents took them. change my room on me but uh oh well i think it looks kind of nice it looks like a adult room as you can see i have my dress uniform on i wore this especially for my parents because well i thought it looked cool i'm also gonna be wearing it a lot this weekend <laughs> So the college hosted the Maritime Fall Fair up here. Uh, you guys have it down in Halifax, we have it here at the college, and everyone from Sydney comes in. Not too many people actually came in though, but it was fun. You know, um, I took a couple of videos of that. It's not where I was aiming, but... <laughs> He's dead though. Just missed him. You should not be allowed to have this one. I want you to I want to wherever you want. I want to I want to I want I went in the dunk tank. Sebastian got me finally. Everyone was missing, but Sebastian got me. And actually, he got me on a free shot. It sucked because uh, he had thrown it a couple times and he missed before so he's like come on i nicked it quite a few times and she's like all right you have a freebie and he got up in dead center sunk me i got him back though i gave him a hug afterwards and soaked him how do you guys like my halloween costume <laughs> colton you already know because you were there when i bought it but uh this is what i'm wearing for halloween i hope you like it <laughs>
All right, it's the morning of the Cabot Trail Run. Um, my team is the last one. We're doing the last leg, so we're going to be the ones crossing the finish line. So we actually leave the latest. It is right now 3.13 in the morning, and uh, we're like the only first years left at the college because everyone else is already out doing their legs of the run. And we're just waiting now. I, I got up a little early because I figured I'm like, get up now, wake myself up a little bit before we leave. We leave at 4 o'clock. And we had to get some stuff together beforehand too. So I'm gonna try to sleep in the van on the way there, just for a little, little last energy boost before I start my run. We're all wearing morph suits. Well, not all of us. Uh, four of the six of my team are gonna wear morph suits. I'm in mine. Uh, you guys already saw what mine was. They don't know yet. I have yet to tell them. I just said I have morph suit. That's it. So I'm waiting. I got it covered up. I want to hide it until the very last. I'm going to pull it out, and I'm going to wear it, <laughs> and I'm just, I want to see who gets creeped out by Slenderman sprinting at them, really, <laughs> it's going to be interesting, but Adrian has red, Catherine has black, Ben has blue, and then I have mine, so it'll be interesting, because nobody else really knows we have morphs either, so when we run, when we run across the finish line, it's going to be four people in morphs. <laughs> So we beat the record. We did it. Oh my god. 15 hours and 54 minutes. We beat, this, we beat the record by 14 minutes. It was awesome. It was such a good feeling. Because my team was running the last leg. So we got to run across the finish line. It was, oh, it was, it was great. And apparently we may have a lot of time. What happened is, like, the mountain area, they're running. And usually it takes, like, usually they were getting out typically around 12 30 out of the mountains but our group got out at 11 30 like they cut an hour off the record time out of the mountains out of the mountains like we're like holy shit but then the team that got it after were full of like slow ass people and they lost an hour and 10 minutes so we were 10 minutes behind the record when we got it. so we we got 24 minutes back so it's, we felt pretty good. We did it differently than everyone else. Everyone else, one person would run half an hour, next person would run half hour. We did a lot of rotation. What happened? What would happen is we did 200 meters. You would sprint, then you sit in the van. Everyone goes through, or everyone in your van goes through, because there's two vans for each leg. So everyone in our van would go through, do your 200 meters, then it would go through again, run your 200 meters. Then you wait. Well, the other van does. There are two sets. Then you do two more sets, they do two more sets. So we did a bunch, like a ton of sprints. That's why we made up so much time. So I think that saved us. But yeah, we beat the record. 15 hours and 54 minutes is going to be tough to beat. It, at least it better be tough to beat. Oh my god. So uh, I'm going to try to get some sleep now. I only got like two hours before I left. So I'm pretty... I'm not tired. But at the same time, it's like... I could use some sleep. My legs are really sore. But yeah, I, I sorry I didn't get the video. I tried to get some pictures, but I didn't get the video. I was a little too hyped up. <laughs> Forgot about it. So that's it for this week. I'm sorry I didn't get the video over Thanksgiving, but I mean, I hope you understand. I was really busy. Uh, I just, you know, finished the cabbage trail, so I'm still kind of tired. Uh, I'm gonna hopefully go get a good meal, and read my book. Oh, that's the other thing. Uh, I've been starting to read the Heroes of Olympus, the second series, the Percy Jackson series. Oh my god, it is amazing. I love it. It's, oh my god, it's so good. I love books that when you're reading it, you're just like, no way, no, no, oh my god, like, that didn't just happen. Or like, oh my god, I could see it coming, the anticipation, you're like, oh my god, wait, wait, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. And then there are other things that just blew me out of the water that I didn't expect. It's such a great book a whole series but I, i'm on the second book right now and the first book is phenomenal i highly highly recommend it okay that's it for this week you guys have a good week and i'll see you next week